From the ancient forests of Patagonia, scientists have unearthed new information that adds to the understanding of climate change in South America. A recent report reconstructs 600 years of climate records in South America and the authors say their evidence points to the conclusion that extreme weather conditions are on the rise in this region. From the southern tip of Patagonia up through Brazil and Peru, scientists used tree ring dating technology to chart climate trends. Leading the research was Mariano Morales. The method uses a tool like a drill. It takes a sample from part of the tree. It's like a biopsy. It takes a sample the size of a pencil. That sample contains all the three rings, which is what we then analyze. With this data and in collaboration with the Earth Institute at the Columbia University in New York, researchers compiled a new South American drought atlas. What the study clearly shows is that the incidence of extreme droughts and extreme wet events um, are increasing and have increased starting about the mid-20th century. And, and they've increased such that over time periods in the past when we might get some of these events every 20 years, uh, they've increased to more likely occurring every 10 years in many regions throughout South America. Countries like Argentina, Latin America's third largest economy, bear witness to this growing trend with recent droughts knocking percentage points off its GDP. There was a strong Niña phenomenon in 2008-2009 that led to perhaps one of the worst droughts in 50 years. But this happened again just a couple of years ago, and this affected Argentina greatly. This is a country that depends on income from commodities, that is the way it is. The economy relies on agricultural exports. The institute is encouraging what Taboada calls intelligent agriculture, a system that increases resilience to adverse climate conditions. The new research does not draw conclusions about how human activity may have affected the trends it has uncovered, but it does underline the region's vulnerability to shifting weather patterns. Joel Richards for CGTN in Buenos Aires.